Alright, welcome back guys, my name is D, and today we're going to go over the Hunter skill build. So for Hunters, it's pretty much straightforward. Um, to start off as Archer, you want to get 3 Owl's Eye, and then max out Vulture's Eye, get double strafing, max that out, go back to uh, improve concentration, max out Owl Eye, and then you can get your arrow shower. So you can max this out or change up early. It really depends on you. So Owl's Eye is just a plus, um, gives you additional decks, while Vulture's Eye actually gives you the range. So that's why you wanna get this before anything else. So once you hit Hunter, uh, you can go a couple of ways depending on what you need. You can go like the trap route right away or the falcon route. Uh, I personally want to get my falcon right away just for the d additional damage. So uh, in order to get the falcon, you need to go Beast Bane, Falcon Mastery. You want to get Blitz Speed so that you can actually um, ha you actually have an AOE skill. And then you want to max out Steel Crow just for the additional bl bl Blitz Speed damage and get at least one detecting. After that, you can pretty much get what you want. I would recommend getting Ankle Snare. Oops. Ankle Snare right away. And then Sandman. These are the skills that will actually help you level. And after that, you can go a couple of ways. Um, I like to get Remove Trap as soon as possible and then Max Out Detecting. It's actually a skill you use a lot in WoW, and then you just get to your other skills that you want. I would recommend, if you PvP a lot, getting um, Shockwave Trap, and at least one point in Freezing Trap, and then getting Landmine. You can actually Landmine stack, and then push it to your opponents, and they pretty much die in one hit. Okay, so you have four points left. Um, I would recommend getting at least one spring trap. It's not really that good, but it could be useful sometimes in well, depending on like situations. But you have three skill points left. So for this, um, you can go a couple of ways. You can just max out um, arrow shower, get talkie box and uh, skid trap if you want or you can get like three uh two more uh three more points on skid trap if you prefer but i don't really use skid trap because unless you like pvp a lot this could actually be useful but yeah it's pretty much the hunter skill build uh, a couple of uh, skills that aren't actually useful are beast bane Blast mine and claymore trap. So don't get those. There's no need for those skills. All right. So if you have any questions, just put it in the comment section below. If you have any friends that are looking for a good skill build for Hunter on Ragnarok Online, just share them the video. I'd greatly appreciate that. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. See you guys next time. All right. Bye.